All right, I know I said I was going to use the normal team next ranked seasons game, but this team was too good to pass on once again. I am on the way, hopefully, to World Series. I want to get that Chipper Jones. This team is almost as good as the one I used yesterday. Honestly, it could have been a lot better. There was, I think, two players I wanted to use. Oh, wait, only one. Yeah, it was Rod Carew. How the hell is he 180,000 stubs? How was that a thing? I wanted to get him at for, at what at second base. I don't know if I wanted to spend 180,000 stubs to get him. Paul Molitor is fine. He's still very good. He's not. I wouldn't say he's as good as Rod Carew, but I mean, he wasn't even as close to as expensive. Anyway, this is the team that's going to be taking the field this game. Jo whoops, Johnny Bench is on or behind. The he is behind the plate, Kevin. This is going to be the first game I use him in ranked seasons. I don't know if I used him in BR. I think I did actually at one point earlier in the season, but ranked seasons 100%. This will be the first time he takes the field. Brooks Robinson is at third base. I could have used George Brett, but I want to use this Brooks Robinson. I, I just got him the last time I leveled up to a diamond, so I, I probably should use him at some point. Ozzie Smith is at, at short. This will be the first time he's being used this season as well. 99 fielding on the left side of the infield right now. At the left side side of the infield or a wall at the local Dairy Queen. Might be the same damn thing. Paul Molitor is at second, like I mentioned. His his fielding is kind of junk. So where the left side of the infield is very good at fielding, the right side of the infield might be lacking because Willie Stargell is at first base. 65 is not bad first base, the way Frank Thomas has been playing. This is like one of those games where I'm using a lot of players I haven't used all season. I think the whole infield is. Although the outfield is players I am very familiar with. Tony Gwynn is in right field. He's amazing. Willie Mays in center field. I stink with him. And Kenny... And Kenny. Ken Griffey Jr. is in left field. And dude, he may have broke out of what I thought was going to be a massive slump for what I've used him so far this season. This was impossible to do for the bullpen of like many team builds. But the starting rotation... Oh, I didn't show the bench yet. The bench is Reggie. Only the 88 because I think the 99 is like... 300,000. Babe Ruth, Frank Thomas, Ricky Henderson, and then Pudge is also on the bench. Tom, can Tom Seaver take the mound, please? Please. I don't want to pitch with Nolan Ryan, but I didn't want to buy somebody else, and then that would just kind of be a waste of stubs because you have a 1 in 5 chance that that fucking bastard takes the hill. Jim Palmer seems decent. He's also there. Christy Matthewson is the fourth starter, and then Warren Spawn is going to be the fifth. Let's see if we can keep the undefeated streak intact. I think I'm 4-0 since I started playing this ranked seasons season? I don't know. At the risk of jinxing it, I just talked about a winning streak. The Houston good luck. Ah, uh, I don't know. Might try and offer this guy a friendly, see if oh, Nolan Ryan's on the mound. Yeah. Then, yeah. I just want to see if I can get one of those teams like yesterday when it's like just a good matchup on paper. But I don't know. I, I doubt I'll take it. What is he hiring a lawyer to find out what the result is? Please, sir, read over the fine print. Mr. Sir. What the hell's happening here? This guy may have ran away from his all right, whatever. From Although this will be the game I shit the bed. <sighs> this is to the point where it's like pause menu. And then there's a baseball game on the side of it. Welcome to the menu 19. Where the side quest is a baseball game. Is he even at his TV? I don't know if he's there. This guy is not at his television set. He's going to come back. Oh, wait a minute. Junior's coming in. Okay, now he is there. What in the... What is happening? Come on, Nolan, you pile of shit. That is just insane how I got out of that. So let me get this correct here. This guy refused to take a friendly and is washing his ass as we speak. Come on, Brooks! What is, what is this guy is not here. He's a myth of a person at this point.
Rams hopefully score 10 runs very quick and then this will be over with soon. Everybody run, just run. Get home immediately. Hell, I need everybody's average to go up. All right, it's finally over. Jesus, I sat here for like 40 minutes waiting for all this shit to happen. Good God. Let's see if we can play somebody who's actually there, who isn't outside feeding the crickets strawberry ice cream. Please be there, post dump. Please. Thank God we don't have Nolan Ryan. That's acceptable. Or Warren Spawn. But this will be the game I get my ass handed to me if, if there's any game ever. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Christy Matthewson doesn't even have a number. He just says, screw it. Man, that windup has to hurt his back. He only has a fastball. Well, he has a screwball, but pretty much only has two pitches. I'm going to have to pitch the game of my life if I want him to be successful with two pitches. What in the hell was that? It actually ended up being a good pitch because who the hell throws high screwballs? That was another one. This is like Christmas for shit's sakes. The opponent is at his TV. He's ready to play. Get out. Gwyn! With a home run. You know what? That's another player I've rarely seen gone deep this season. Might be a base hit machine. When it comes to going deep, Gwyn is not doing it. Holy! Ball was rocking it to the third baseman. That has to be that the goalie from Iceland's hand from D2. Or am I thinking of the wrong movie? I probably am. But one of the Mighty Ducks movies. The hand. That's gonna get down, I think. Yeah. What the hell's going on with Griffey? Griffey is a man possessed the last two games. Wow, that, that might be three in a row. Or no, it isn't. Or is it? Oh, it doesn't matter anyway. And he's late on the heat every time. Late on the fastball. Must be sitting screwball. Good one. Very good one. He went with it, though. This is Tony Gwynn. Nothing gets by Gwynn. Jesus, that was just a nice hit. Oh, no. Oh, no. I, I really messed that up. Very bad. Yee! Yee! Change the plan. Oh, I think it's safe to say this might be an offensive explosion if Russell Martin is hitting home runs. This might be 58 to 50 four by the time this is over with and he strikes him out here so all right no surprise i'm losing early it may have been seven home runs hit already i think that's yeah or four four home runs not even the end of the second oh, if he's locating that slider there right now i might as well head off the field he walked Willie Stargell. I probably would have been frozen if that was in the zone. I was not even close to swinging at that. Paul Molitor. Molitor. Turn back the clock to 92, buddy. Or 93. That was kind of blue. Dude. I don't know. The pitcher is unstoppable at the plate. Put a damn bat in the pitcher's hands. Run away. Aussie. Ah, it might be my fault. It is my fault. That was not good at all. Just get rid of the home run ball. Keep everything in the ballpark and it should be all right. Dude, what is with these fucking screwballs being hung? Damn it! Jesus, Griffey is just a base hit machine for everybody now. Christy Matthewson might be getting the heave ho in a second. And I mean a legitimate second. If he gives up another home run, the bullpen is on fire. Dude, I'm telling you right now, catchers with like 50 blocking are better than people with high 90s. Jimmy Fox would have caught that standing backwards with a piece of toast on his face and make that the catcher's mask. Pudge and J Johnny Bench can't block a ball. Look at Gwyn. Gwyn's on fire. Am I gonna have to start using Gwyn more? This might be a triple. 
No. Oh, he, he go. No, no, go. Get ready for that upstairs fastball, Willie. That's what everyone seems to go to against Mays. Up and in. What the? F did he press the jump button? Because if he did, that might be the worst thing I've ever seen in the field. I better not choke this, or I stink. I was saying too. Yeah. I was saying he might go upstairs. Look for that upstairs cheese. Right in this vicinity. Wait for it upstairs. Willie Stargell with the grand slam. I know this is Toronto, but balls are flying out of the stadium at this point. Jeez, he was wasting no time. Although, I might be in the same situation. Johnny Bench. Johnny Bench hit a home run. Everybody's hitting home runs. Wow, he almost got that out still. This is a hitting frenzy. And it might not stop. Jesus Christ, if he if he went deep I'm a box of shit. What the hell am I doing? Yeah, like that was that was supposed to be low. That's my fault. Oh my god. Yeah. I might just get the pen warming up now, so when it when it all goes to shit, I can just bring somebody in immediately. Man, Griffey is never leaving the lineup at this point. Brooks Robinson it only sends balls to the right center gap. Stargell almost did it again. If I actually moved the PCI in like a fucking idiot, then Stargell would have hit another home run. Would have had seven RBIs. Dude, that was close. Yeah, all they had to do was boom, pull it in. Or what? That didn't sound right. Push it to the left or the right. I don't know if that sounded right either. There's no way that that could have possibly sound right by saying anything. Move the PCI to the right side, and that's what sounds right. I might honestly take Matthewson out of this game. Depends, actually. Wow, this guy's kind of getting unlucky, too. Reggie, let's go, buddy. Although this isn't the 99, Reggie's going to get the job done. Oh, wait. It's not going to be Reggie. It's going to be Frank. Why not Frank? Oh my, if I was on that, man, that is destroyed. He may have just gave me the two best pitches I've ever seen in my life. Man, see if I can... Okay. Two. Maldivar, if you booted that. Look at Billy Wagner with the tuxedo. He's going to a wedding for fuck's sake. He didn't even bring a present. And that looked really weird. That looked like it was going to land like 50 feet in front of the right fielder. It kept sailing. That's right down the middle. Willie Mays, finally. Even Willie Mays is hitting the ball hard. What? <laughs> that was uh, very close at second base. I don't know about that. Is that going to get down? No. Man, Billy Wagner's fastball is almost untouchable in this game. Man, oh man, I might leave Billy in the rest of this game. Dude, Johnny Bench is kind of putting the ball in play here good too. This is a surprise. Man, every single time Ozzie Smith has came to the plate, he's got a fastball down the middle. Tony Gwynn is destroying the ball. No, stay. What am I doing? I am such... 
That's a three-run shot, probably, if I wasn't an idiot. I am fucking dog urine. Man, I am spitting everywhere. Get that Brooks 99 feeling. Close your eyes and throw it. I thought for sure that was going to be booted after the pitcher single. Speaking of fire, when the ball comes off the bat, I mean, that wasn't hit hard, but he got another base hit. Man, I am just missing some of these balls. Oh, no. The worst. The worst. Oh, God. That was awful. Hey man, a couple bloops and a blast, and this guy is right back in this thing. Different scouting report than we have right here. This looks like a beautiful situation for a double play right here. But he can Gwyn is a hero. Defense is on guard, and you know I don't know why I threw that. That was really stupid of me. That could have been the blast. If I wasn't just awful at everything, Johnny Bench and Willie Stargell would have like five hits each. Ah! Babe Ruth needed to get on the action, but that's just another fail. Is Ozzy Smith finally gonna get a hit? No. This game, everything that I was actually on and didn't miss by a million feet was destroyed. Absolutely destroyed. That's a nice pitch. This is like the only reliever I can locate anything with. I may have spoken too soon. Well, nonetheless, that does stay in somehow. Everything this game that was actually put in play that I didn't miss by a million feet may have had like vegetable dip coming off the ball. Ken Griffey Jr. was the one who bought it. Three for four. Willie Stargell could have had like at least three hits if I wasn't in. But he had six RBIs. How many home runs were you? I see seven right there. There's probably more up. This is crazy. I am starting to have second guesses about the normal team in ranked seasons. The last two teams I used, double digit hits and runs, I think, were put up. May have to make some tough decisions. Very tough. Because I guess I haven't really used those players, some of them, in a long time, so. Maybe they'll be destroying everything too. Ah, uh, I'll be it. This was a success. A success. Sorry. <laughs>